Epilepsy is treated with medications that either decrease the excitability of the individual brain cells or decrease the spread of excitation within the brain. So um, there are several classes of anti-seizure medications. They exert their effects through uh, various different mechanisms. By mechanisms, I mean uh, precisely where these drugs go and bind onto the brain cell. Uh, sometimes they bind to receptors. Sometimes they alter the properties of the cell membrane. Sometimes they bind to synapses, which are the connections between brain cells, and uh, disrupt uh, flow of information from cell to cell. The important thing to remember is that uh, regardless of what uh, mechanism is employed, none of these mechanisms that these drugs target are unique to the epileptic parts of the brain. These drugs exert their effects all across the brain, and that can become a limiting factor in terms of how much medication can you use before the healthy parts of the brain start to experience side effects or uh, problems because of uh, the effects of the medication. The selection of the drugs, when, especially when you combine drugs with other uh, seizure medications, depends a lot upon the mechanisms of action, whether you're combining two different mechanisms, mechanisms or not, how they are excreted. So there are a lot of subtleties in how you pick medications in the context of other medications the patient may be on.